BASF recovery team. I have noticed in the past few years that the four-door Jeep JK has become a very popular vehicle. And not just on the pavement, it's become a common sight on the trails too. Recently, the team was invited to tag along for Park Jeep's customer appreciation trail ride event, which included a number of JK owners fairly new to the off-roading experience. As you all know, Jeep has a very long history in the off-roading world, and some may argue that it all started with this model here. And then there was the legendary CJ, which seemed to become the standard that all other 4x4s were compared to. And, of course, the major engineering changes that came out with the redesign of the TJ has certainly proved its capability of living up to the Jeep legend. But what about the JK? Is it just a mall crawler or will it continue the Jeep's legend as a very capable off-road vehicle? Like many longtime off-roaders, I was very skeptical when Jeep came out with this model and all of its comfort features and actually slightly displeased with some of the styling changes. So here's a little footage of some JKs running on the trail along with a couple of TJs and you can judge for yourself. Of course, like any off-road vehicle, they can and will get stuck from time to time. And like it or not, they are becoming more and more popular on the trails. Thanks for watching PSF Recovery Team. Keep wheeling, stay safe, and maybe we'll see you out there in the woods. Yeah. You still running? Everything's good? Oh, yeah, I think everything's good. I never, I never shut it off or anything, so okay. Yeah, he's just trying to drain.
Yeah. He's got like five yeah, piles. There should be a plug underneath, right? Uh, there's a plug under there somewhere. Yeah. It's supposed to be holding it all, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> How many gallons will they hold? <laughs> One and a half. <laughs> Feel it. There we go. 